Hi, I'm Nadine Williams and I'm here with the Gorilla Glue Company. We're here at the National Train Show in Milwaukee, Wisconsin, learning about trains, model trains, and understanding what they're using adhesives on and exhibiting and learning a little bit more about the hobby. Hi, I'm here with Charles Mosier and we are here at a train display built by uh, their club the and their Chicago hobby. Land Escagers. And Charles, tell me, how long have you been in the hobby? I've been in this hobby for a little over 60 years now. The original American Flyers were made on the south side of Chicago and then they were bought out by A.C. Gilbert, which was in New Haven, Connecticut. And now they're owned by Lionel. Wow. And, and you guys get together for yeah. these type of events yeah. And, and... Yeah, this is the 75th year for this organization here. What has, oh. what has kept you coming back for so long? It's fun. It just kind of nurtures you. You can just sit there and watch a train go to nowhere every day and let your imagination go, you know? Wow. That's the whole thing. You just sit there and watch it. There's no stress. They didn't have all this electronic stuff that they have today where the train whistles and talks to you and blows smoke and stops and blows steam. Our stuff, you lucky, you know, the motor ran around the track. Amazing. Well, thank you again for You're sharing welcome. a little bit of your story with us. You're welcome. You're welcome. I'm here with Mark, and, and you're a model builder and, and uh, a train expert and a historic expert, which is amazing. So, can you tell me a little bit about your set that we have behind you? Well, we've recreated the Chicago L, and it's got, I'm sure, recognizable sections that you would see here in Chicago. Uh, it, everything's wood, made of wood. Um, it's the third rail system, so we've got that in here too. The building in the background actually is uh, the Ford Motor Company of Canada, which this plant was built in about 1916. And we also have the original plant here. It's not on this particular layout, but it was 1904, and it was the Walkerville Wagon Works first and became Ford Motor Company, which I used to work for for a while, and I was able to get into the archives, which started me into the history, which got me into recreating all this. Thank you for joining us for the National Model Railroad Association's 75th anniversary. This is Nadine and Holly signing off.